Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning to you wherever you are in the world. I'm Robert Miles, and I have some news. Over the last several months, life has changed significantly for Sarah and I, as we welcome Thea to the world a year to the day of our first show and the very day of the Groundlings Choice Awards. This has necessitated a step back from many day-to-day -day operations, and Matthew Rhodes and Emily Ingram have bravely stepped in, most significantly during the incredible month of Marlowe, which brought a series of plays, casts and creatives together to crack open another corner of the Western canon to huge success. During this return to weekly shows, seeing and supporting this from the outside for the first time, it became clear to me that connecting audiences and creatives across the globe through classical texts takes a huge energetic toll on those who make The Show Must Go Online what it is. Together, we have sustained unparalleled productivity and innovation in the digital theatre space for 15 months now. We've created more art and connected more artists in the pandemic than any of the world's best funded institutions, all powered solely by our collective passion for the life-saving power of the arts. Now, mounting external pressures and priorities must naturally take precedence for the whole team, and it has become clear to all of us that the scale of effort necessary is no longer possible in an unfunded model. That's why we've taken the decision to put The Show Must Go Online into a chrysalis. We must first take time to recover, then consider carefully what the future might look like, and whether TSMGO can realistically attract the kind of funding and institutional support necessary to make work on this scale truly sustainable for those who participate. When TSMGO emerges, it will necessarily have undergone a transformation, and we hope an exciting and beautiful one. We wish to take this time to thank every single one of our hundreds of creative contributors for their shared passion, for their artistry, for their unparalleled commitment, their hours, their efforts, their blood, sweat and tinfoil, for the laughs, the tears, the magical moments. We also want to thank our audiences in over 60 countries for joining us to experience a frontier in digital theatre, for supporting us as we learned and grew in front of you, and for your generosity over more than a year in donating to the Patreon Hardship Fund. The Patreon itself will soon be redefined to support us as we attempt to explore the possible evolutions of TSMGO. Details of this new offer and approach, as well as the core team's Patreon pages, will be made available as exclusive content. I want to personally thank Matthew Rhodes and Emily Ingram, Elliot Borneman and Adam Gibson for their incredible efforts over the last months, to all of those who helped make the month of Marlowe a success, and indeed everyone who made the whole run of shows such a success, including, of course, the wonderful Ben Crystal and Ruth Page. Before we bring this historic second phase of TSMGO to a close, we're excited to announce one final show. So pull out your calendars, set aside 7pm Wednesday, September 8th. That's 7pm BST, Wednesday, September 8th, for our final freely available public performance of William Shakespeare's The Two Noble Kinsmen, directed by none other than TSMGO's very own valedictorian, Matthew Rhodes. There will be exclusive insights, details and more available, of course, as exclusives on the Patreon page. The connections made in this community will continue to blossom out in the wider world for years to come in ways that we can't yet foresee, the consequences of which I'm already excited to discover every day, with every new talent that gets picked up, every in-person show that gets made, every future venture that will take place, perhaps even in states unborn and accents yet unknown. I hope you're excited too, and that you'll look back fondly on the time we've spent together apart around the world, sharing our passion for Shakespeare and his contemporaries. I want to thank you and ask you to stay tuned to our Patreon and social media for further details. We'll speak soon.